Uh, my name is Sam Cosma. I'm a controls and safety system specialist with AutoPro Automation. I work with the SIS group here primarily uh, uh, doing functional and process safety lifecycle services for our clients. A difference between a HAZOP and a CHAZOP really is, is the focus. Uh, a HAZOP looks at the entire facility, the mechanical equipment and the process, where a CHAZOP looks at the control system itself. A HAZOP assumes, typically assumes that the control system is operating correctly, whereas a CHAZOP goes into the control system and fails individual components. We do a CHAZOP to identify uh, single points of failure, um, to identify potential failures and, and help the operations recognize those failures, to give them an opportunity to react faster, uh, get maintenance on, on the, the job faster, with the goal, primary goal being to minimize uh, downtime and production outage, especially in critical control applications, where we can add a little bit of redundancy for a small price, um, whereas a failure in that could lead to you know, a significant outage of, of a day or, or a couple of days. The difference between a coarse chaz op and a more detailed chaz op is not only timing, but, but the focus. A coarse chaz op looks at a very high level um, block diagrams uh, very early in the, in the design stage to determine whether um, there are any significant issues that we can correct early in the process. A detailed um, design happens later and looking uh, at, at every element. So we look at um, I.O. modules, uh, CPUs, servers, networks, and different layers and, and, and of communication as well to uh, try and determine um, you know, individual failures and, and what they look like, what to do about them, how to safeguard against them.